The Collider mission. You guys have to get ready. Head to the equipment room and gear up. Nice to meet you, future Leo. Yeah, congrats on growing out of your awkward stage. <laughs> hey, why don't you just bring future Adam, Bree, and Chase with you? Let me guess, you just hopped in the time machine and took off without them. That is so future me. <laughs> Actually, that's why I'm here. Adam, Bree, and Chase don't make it to the future. What? Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! I forgot to pack my pudding. <laughs> What do you mean Adam, Bree, and Chase don't make it to the future? You sent me back here with a video that will explain everything. Well, what is that? It's a holophone. I invented the holophone? No, but you did wait in line six days to get one. <laughs> Greeting, Past Donald. That's me? Please tell me the holophone adds 100 pounds. Even if it did, what about the other 200? The next seven years are pretty hard on you, Big D. Or should I say, Bigger D. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> if you are watching this, we cracked time travel! Ha <laughs> ha! Interdimensional high five. <laughs> I just high-fived my future self. <laughs> what? Look at me! Let me have some joy! I sent Leo back in time to stop you from sending Adam, Bree, and Chase on the Particle Collider mission. What? Why? Now, I'm sure you're asking, what? Why? <laughs> I know myself so well. <laughs> As a scientist, I am loath to change the past, but in this case, I have to make an exception. Adam, Bree, and Chase don't return from the mission. Send an automated rover in their place. It's the only chance we have to save them. Oh, and by the way, <clears throat> every time you say, hey, I think this calls for a cookie, think about this. <laughs> How could I send them on a mission they don't return from? And how could you have let your hair recede with so many trusted over-the-counter remedies available? If Adam, Bree, or Chase hear any of this, it, it'll shake their confidence in future missions or their confidence in me. Please tell me you won't say anything to them. I promise. Future me speaks for both of us. <laughs> There's not much time. The, the collider situation's getting worse by the hour. I gotta go build that rover. Good to go, Mr. Davenport. We'll check in once we reach Delta Point. No! Uh, I, I mean, the mission's off. But you said it was urgent. Did I say urgent? I, th I, th I think I said urging. I was like, I was urging you not to go on the mission. <laughs> Why? Because I'm sending an automated rover that can shut down the collider via remote. <clears throat> as soon as I build it. An automated rover? You might as well send a handbag on a skateboard. <laughs> the three of us can handle this. No! I said no, and I mean it. My decision is final. Now, just everybody go get ready for school. Thank you. Future you would thank you too, Big D. Or should we say, Bald D? <laughs> <laughs>